We're here at the SHOT Show 2018 with Mr. John Pink from Remington. One of the big stories from Remington is their Model 700 PCR, Precision Rifle. Yeah. Let me grab one over here, Randy, so we can uh, actually walk through it. Well, it looks like it's actually being handled right now. Well, we can come so, back to it in a moment, yeah. maybe. Yeah, but our 700 Precision Chassis Rifle. This was a chassis rifle developed in-house by the Remington R&D engineers, okay? So from the ground up, designed around the Model 700. So one of the big differentiators right there is it's a chassis purpose-built for the Model 700, the most popular bolt-action centerfire rifle, sporting rifle of all times. You know, been the, the, the king of the hill for 53 years. So it's used by more custom gun builders, U.S. Army, U.S. Marine Corps, and our, our foreign allies. It's used by more custom gun builders. But the Model 700, you know, designed for accuracy and its strength, chassis system that has a Magpul Gen 3 PRS stock, Magpul grip, it comes with a five round uh, Magpul synthetic magazine. We're having this chambered in 260 Remington, 65 Creedmoor, and 308 Winchester. 308 Winchester is a 1 in 10 rated twist, and your 65 and 260 are both in a 1 in 8 rated twist. Okay, now every model 700 PCR comes with a printout confirming its sub-MOA accuracy. That is correct. So how exactly do you confirm the accuracy of each and every individual rifle? So each one of these rifles will be shot on the same range as Randy as our military and defense firearms. So the rifle goes into a fixture that holds it in place and it settles back into the same place, shot to shot. It's not actually shooting at a piece of paper. This is our computer-aided targeting system, or PATS for short. And it's four microphones that are downrange at 100 yards, and those four microphones can acoustically pick up on the placement of where each and every one of those bullets is going. Okay. And that's exactly the same system used for the U.S. military. It's the exact same system that we use for the U.S. military. That's exactly right. Now the so other thing actually, too... Are Yep, it's actually a printout of where those bullets went, okay, and showing the mean radius and what that equates to in a minute of angle calculation. But each one of these will be sub MOA shot with the Remington match ammunition. I've noticed the price point on the 700 PCR is quite a bit less than some of the competition. It is. Our, it's not a super duper expensive rifle. No, but it's not a super expensive rifle. A lot of folks here that I've asked at the show, you know, what would you expect to, to be able to find this? And they're all saying around $2,000. Our MSRP is $1,199. And as you and I both know, Randy, most guns retail well below what, what a standard MSRP is. Yeah, so we'll be looking at maybe a thousand dollars and change. So it's up yeah. to the individual dealer, That's of course, exactly right. right? And like all Remington's manufactured since 2016, yeah. comes with a lifetime guarantee. Is that correct? And lifetime warranty <laughs> applies. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, John. Thank the you. Actual Remington Model 700 Precision Rifle, yeah. again with Mr. John Fink. Yep. You can see, we, we comes with, with a rail mounted on it. Our oversized bolt handle for an easy bolt throw. Patchable box magazine, which is a Magpul magazine, a Magpul grip, and their Gen 3 PRS stock that's adjustable for length of pull, comb height, as well as camp. Just about everything. Yeah. Well, that should fit most everyone. Um, what's the quality of the trigger? Yeah, this is our Xmark Pro externally adjustable trigger. Right. So it's adjustable in a range from three and a half pounds to five. The muzzle is also threaded with a 5 8 by 24 thread pitch on it. So for states where silencers are legal or for silencer owners, they have a direct thread option here or for any other muzzle device, such as muzzle brakes or flash hiders. Those could be adapted to the rifle. The rifling on the inside, which is obviously something you can't see, is our 5R rifling, which was developed in 1981 in conjunction with the U.S. Army and the M24 program. 
So instead of six lands, we have five lands that also don't come to a flat the way they do on a six lane. So you have less bearing surface on the bullet. Okay. So a lower frictional coefficient as that bullet is traveling down the bore. So you get higher muzzle velocity for a flatter trajectory, more energy downrange, and you get less copper found. So you can shoot for extended periods before you start seeing accuracy degradation. Would it be fair to say that the 5R rifling is most effective with a certain weight of bullet, meaning the heavier bullets? It tends to shoot better, that is true, Randy. But the heavier heavy bullets are exactly... Yeah. But the heavier bullets, heavy for, for caliber bullets, are exactly what you would be using for a thousand yard rifle anyway. That's exactly right. So it makes perfect sense. So in the 308, your 168s, your 175s tend to shoot much better. Um, I personally like the 175s better. Okay. Yep. You'll do well with this one, John. Yep. Thanks, Randy.